the person who keeps the spirit. Of the E traditional bamboo musical instrument and is well known for his talent in crafting traditional and folk musical instruments of the Eid ethnic group. With his skillful hands and passion for traditional musical instruments, he worked hard to learn from older artisans over 10 years old. He made the first bamboo musical instruments. Traditional music accompanies him every step of the way. He said that the secret to getting a standard instrument in terms of quality, shape and sound is that the secret to getting a standard instrument in terms of quality, shape and sound is that the bamboo tube as a musical instrument must be chosen not too old with the necessary thinness for great reverberation if the material is too old. It will be hard and difficult to manipulate if young. The sound is distorted and the shape is easily deformed. The gourd selected as a musical instrument must be a traditional gourd of the right size and age and allowed to dry naturally. He is one of the very few Eid artisans who not only has extensive knowledge of traditional and folk Eid instruments, but is also the one who manufactures and performs most of these instruments. His mastery in making and performing musical instruments is the result of a long process of research and experimentation. Let E traditional music spread over time. Through his observation and learning, Emma H alone has accumulated a deep understanding of the traditional musical instrument making of his father. Also from primitive natural materials such as bamboo, wood, dried gourd, buffalo horn, and a sharp knife, he revived musical instruments that had fallen asleep in the memory of many Eid. People such as Dingir, Chinkram. He masterfully crafted and performed bamboo musical instruments, Dingir, Ding Tak, Ding Takde, Dang Boat, Chinkram, Trung, Kip, Prison, and Ding Klut. To this day, he doesn't remember himself, made many musical instruments, serving cultural and artistic activities in his village in particular. He was the first person to use oak, incense, and octopus to make kip horns and horns to replace buffalo horns. His kip made of this material sound no less than that of buffalo horn. In 2014, when he was invited with artists in Dak Lak to perform in the Samelo International Folk Music Festival program in Finland, he brought a large box of musical instruments and bamboo materials to introduce a culture, dyke. The public in your country was extremely interested and admired by his simple musical instruments and performance. From 2015 to now, he and his wife and daughter have participated in daily activities, introducing typical cultural features of the Eid people to tourists at the ethnic culture and tourism village of Vietnam. Thanks to his active work, the traditional and folk music of the Eid people from the instruments he made and performed resounded, spreading strongly not only in his hometown. At 80 years old, he is still enthusiastic, going to the ethnic culture and tourism village of Vietnam, so that ethnic groups and tourists everywhere can know the beauty of our Eid culture making musical instruments so that his father's precious assets do not fall asleep. There are many different types of musical instruments. A Vietnamese ethnic groups, these instruments are used to accompany singing, dancing, solos, concerts, etc. These instruments are also used in festivals and cultural activities of each ethnic group. Vietnam is a country with a rich and diverse treasure of traditional musical instruments. That treasure was formed during the life journey and the long history of nation building and defense. There are musical instruments created on the spot with local characteristics. There are instruments imported from many different ways but have been nationalized and localized to suit the music language and musical aesthetic. Vietnam, in total, there are several hundred different genera of musical instruments. Here are the most typical Vietnamese musical instruments. Thank you for watching all of my videos.
please subscribe to share so you don't miss my other interesting videos. I love Vietnam. Thank <laughs> you. 